In the early 18th century, amidst the rigor of Prussian discipline and the shadows of an authoritarian regime, a forbidden love story unfolds. This is the tale of Frederick the Great, a young prince with a spirit too liberal for his time, and Hans Hermann von Katte, a courageous officer whose loyalty knew no bounds. Their bond, deepened by dreams of a different life and a shared disdain for the harsh militarism imposed by Frederick's father, King Frederick William I, grew into a love that dared to challenge the status quo. In the confines of a repressive court, their secret meetings became the only solace in a world that demanded conformity. However, whispers of their closeness soon reached the ears of the king, igniting his fury. Faced with the threat of separation in the stifling future that awaited Frederick, they concocted a daring plan to escape to England, where Frederick hoped to live a life of freedom and enlightenment. But fate had other plans. The escape was foiled and their hopes shattered. Captured and accused of treason, they found themselves ensnared in the merciless gears of royal justice. King Frederick William I, driven by a desire to crush any challenge to his authority and to set an example, ordered the execution of Hans Hermann von Katte. In a final act of cruelty, he forced Frederick to witness the decapitation of his confidant, his friend, his love. Veuillez pardonner mon cher Kat, au nom de Dieu, pardonne-moi il n'y a rien à pardonner, je meurs pour toi avec la joie dans le cœur. » This farewell, spoken in the language of their learned and intimate conversations, underscored the tragedy of their separation. As Hans met his fate with dignity, the impact of this moment on Frederick would forever shape his reign, leaving a mark of sorrow and resolve on the soul of the future king.